Denver Public Schools new safety plan out today rehashes a lot of what the district was already doing. It keeps armed officers in schools, adds mental health services for students, lets individual schools decide if they want weapons detection systems, and says that the district's internal safety team members need to be there when they're doing weapons pat downs. Still fuzzy though on some of the details on armed officers. But a good part of the plan is a work in progress. Uh, perfect example is even the SROs. Mm -hmm. We have yet to establish a new memo of understanding, which we refer to as an MOU, mm -hmm. for obvious reasons. We have transition in the city, so Mayor-elect Johnson will soon to be mayor. Uh, we have uh, a great chief of police, and uh, he's willing to collaborate, but we have to have that transition happening uh, before we sit down and uh, you know put pen to paper. Superintendent Alex Marrero says even if they don't have a long-term deal with Denver Police by the start of the school year, those 14 police officers who are on DPS campuses at the end of the last school year will be returning come fall.